cutter, a broke one, and then after that, I I upgrade. <laughs> no, I, I think it's better because it, the, the the ones that are just normal that are around are, are too advanced. So yeah, at least now you can start with basics and build it up from the ground. You know what I'm saying? I play I play builder honey with the with the right mindset, the right principles. You know what I'm saying? And then I bring it into the in the sequel mode life. I say, girl, let me show you. Let me show you how we do this life thing, you know what I'm saying? With the right principles. <laughs> With the right principles. The right and then principles. we can all we can oh. all go on a trial date, all three of us. With our with our hands. Right? Conversation. Hmm? On the conversation we had, for you you have you need to get someone who that you can take from the ground, develop the mind up the basics so we had the culture not someone who already gonna, who's gonna yeah, want to compete it. with you no nah, it's not gonna, yeah, it's not gonna, gonna work. work it's, it's not, gonna, it's work. not gonna, work. gonna work because for you you it's more than just money your world that's is it. more of mindset that's it i'm not sure if you get what i'm saying exactly so for you you need someone that, I think, I think, I think Junior <laughs> likes an example here. Come on. It's too much. Wait, Sven, let me tell you, I don't even miss being single. Oh, I, I, it's too nice. <laughs> yeah, I must be like Junior. It's nice. Let me tell you, bro, you know, when Junior was still in Joburg, when sometimes I'd be hungry, you know, when obviously, because I, I, I lived alone yeah. in my crib, I would just say, Junior, where are you? He says I'm home. And I catch him like six o'clock. Because I know they're cooking him dinner. I say, no, that's fine. I'm on the way. <laughs> and then I go there to eat. Because I know his honey's cooking. <laughs> the nice thing. <laughs> so I used to go eat a juniors. <laughs> mm. Yeah. You can cook. Yeah. Then you can make yeah. a stop cooking. Because you have to manage in business now. Not the one who's already saying, no, nah. man, I'm the business. No, nah. no, 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 that's all. Because, you want to see how uh, traditional they are first. Be, be, before we travel the world, what, what, let, you know, just on, on, on a basic level of life, like, let, let's forget the money and all of that. Yeah. Are we taking yeah. care of each other first and stuff now? Because obviously, as we grow, you obviously don't want to cook in the whole time. And they're like, hey, we're going to become Chairman's Club and stuff now. You already know, okay, now. She's going to share all the customers this side and all of that. And the nice thing is that everything that she's already cooking, she's already using the products anyway. So already the customers also want to use the same thing. They're like, hey, you know what? Maybe it's the, the secret is in the cooking also. And I add herbal life into it also. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then we get a nice shift. You know what I'm saying? Easy. But before, before all of that, the basics must be right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It starts with the... It starts with the basics. When the basics are right, and then we can everything else. But if the basics aren't right, ah, it's not gonna work. Yeah. Yeah. Because listen, you don't want a girl that maybe when you're driving, you know, one of your cars, you know, is making a big deal out of that. Yeah. Because that's not what you stand for. You are home and welcoming, you're all about people and all of that and all the material things you have and all of that. You don't, you don't have those kind of things to make people feel small and all of that. Of which right now we're living in a world where people are using materials, uh, material stuff just to make other people yeah. you know, feel small and all of that. Now imagine a girl like I'm with Seiko, this, this no. our kind, all of that. No, 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 no. You want grounded, the ground, grounded, grounded, you know, grounded. 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 Facts. That's what, dog, let me tell you, right? You know? That's why I'm single, bro. Because I know that, yo, I want the day, the day that I say, yo, you know what I'm saying? I don't, it must be my last, dog. I, I can't draw that 10 times, you know what I'm saying? I must be like Junior. The next one to catch me must take me out of the game forever. <laughs> yeah, it, it's the same as if you build your herbal life business right. Or like, why must you waste time trying to, you, you, you know what I'm saying? You already know that, ah, no, at least this one, it, it, it's like, yeah, exactly. You, 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 life is about you doing it right in the first place. Why That's try it. many different businesses and you're failing on this business, this business, this business, yeah. this business. When you get the right one, phew, you're gone. Phew, Microsoft. 100%. I know. I'm no, a boy for you right now. We're praying for I'm you. I'm a boy. Don't worry. Let's, you know, let me tell you, praying. bro. Let me tell you. You know, the, they say good things I, take time. So God, God is cooking her. 
God is cooking her. And when she comes, my boy, she comes, she's going to come rare. <laughs> she's going to be a rare breed. You know what I'm saying? I'm also, I'm also not rushing it. You know what I'm saying? It's not a, you know. But Junior, here's a question. How do you then think um, Siko is going to get one? No, so no, no. I'm, around, I'm, I'm not chasing. You know, I'm not looking. Test. I'm not looking. God is going to bring light? her. God is going to bring her from the platter. God is going to say, my son, <laughs> <laughs> here, here, is the, here is the wife. Here, here is the wife that's going to take this empire to the top. You know what I'm saying? I'm not looking. I'm not chasing. not looking. None of that shit. You know what I'm saying? God, God's going to bring her. Deliver her. But in a serious note, bro, like, nah, honestly, we pray. Don't worry, pray guys. for Seagull. I'm going to join I mean, you guys. I'm going to join you guys. Trust me. I'm going to join you. You, Junior. You, Junior. Every single night, you should go down on your knees, bro, and be grateful and thank God. Bro, you have no idea hey, Junior, how stuck you are. Junior, honestly, the, bro. The streets are tough. Let me tell oh, you. Boy. It's tough out here. <laughs> Luck comes with crazy. preparation, my boy, and stuff now. So... Even if I was lucky, if I was not prepared, where's the luck? You know what I'm saying? So it's a matter of... Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's another no. point right now. Yeah, you know what I'm going to say, right? Because, so, in other, so in other words, um, Junior, you are saying, you know, you can be given, you know, something good. But if you are in a position where... If whatever that you were given is good, because you too, you were never prepared. And in other words, you are saying you were prepared, my boy. So now tell me, what would you advise um, um, Siko, for example? What do you mean by being prepared? What would you say he should do right now? So that whatever comes, he's prepared. Hey, you know, if it's a situation where we're speaking about, for example, like you lucky and all of that and stuff now there's this saying he who finds a wife finds a good thing so it's kind of like if you're gonna align yourself you must align yourself like the kind of partner you want to be and then when life becomes reflective it's going to you're going to be aligned with the partner that's also working on becoming a wife the same way as you worked on becoming a one percenter and i think that's where it then starts complementing each other because being a wife has nothing to do with making money. It's about using your true feminine energy to multiply whatever you do. So if you are a truly feminine woman, you don't have to prove that you are a man and you work with what God gave you best and you just focus on being the best woman possible and stuff now. And as a result of that, you don't have to pretend you are something that you are not because eventually you're going to get tired and stuff now. So when you lead with what God gave you, you can then become your best authentic self. So you know what? I now you already know you as a man, you, you, can't, you can't turn a boy into a man. A man must become and stuff now. So the truth is men and females at their early 20s need to be working on who they want to be 10 years from now. So guys that are young, they think they have all the time in the world and they waste it. Women, while they're young, they get all the, the nice things up front. And sometimes it gets so nice that you actually don't forget to plan ahead. And then when now later on at a later stage when both sides did not prepare, you now get the other side of life, which is a life of non-preparing. And that's going to be a very depressing life. Yeah. So everyone needs to sacrifice the short-term instant gratification for the long-term fulfillment. Is it worth it for me to be a young girl playing old people games and stuff now? Or do I use this time now to prepare myself for later so that I don't then tarnish myself, whatnot? And then you as a guy also are saying, right now, do I need to have adult responsibilities and overstress myself when I have not become who I no. need to be yet and stuff now. So it's a catch 22 on both sides, but it's about understanding on both sides, everyone has this responsibility to work on what they're supposed to work on so that even when you have a relationship, you understand that when you are a man of purpose and stuff now, 
uh, your life as a business. So if you're going to be spending most of your life with your partner, your partner also needs to make sure that during that half of your life where she's also part of your life, she's also part of your business. And when a woman becomes an asset, you just already know half of the time while you're building a relationship, you're also building a legacy. Mm -hmm. And what becomes more valuable than money is a family that has got your four, your your core values instilled uh, as well. Uh, you, you've got the freedom of time to take your kids around the world, expose them to learning before they even go to school, all those things. So this is a lifelong thing. The biggest mistake people make is that when they get married, they think that's the end and that's only the start. So most people, they, their goal is to get married, not to be a wife. Some guys just want to be married. They don't want to be a husband. But mm. that's a lifelong journey um, yeah. and stuff now. So that's the problem is when you hit the goal and you didn't aim for anything above the goal, that's where all the problems start. So if you just get the ring because you wanted it, not because you understand that it's a responsibility, and if you are a gent, you just want to give your commitment away easy, then you're also not going to get quality as well. Everyone needs to have standards, and standards need to be met by you meeting the standards before you demand one. That's powerful. That's powerful. Yeah, that's powerful. And this is exactly yeah. You know what it, you know what it also is, right? I'm going to say this, right? I think what I like about Junior and Junior's relationship is Junior manifested it. Like, I think... You know, you know, you know what the thing with Junior is, bro? Junior, Junior lives his life by the book. So Junior learns all this information and whatnot. And, like, he's like a computer. And then... He, he lives his life based on those principles and whatnot. So even Junior studied like the thing of like being, he knew that this is a type of woman I want, this is a type of guy I must be. You know what I'm saying? So, so because he knew yeah. that it was already in his head, he already like manifested the type of woman he wanted. And even when he, when he saw his partner, he knew that, yo, he already knew what qualities to look for in the person. And okay, she's got one, two, three, four, five qualities I can build with this person. That, that's how Junior is. Junior's, but wait, Junior's all logic. Junior's very logical. Junior's very logical. So I think yeah. from that standpoint, that's why like he was able to get the like the relationship and whatnot he wanted. And he, and he, he also wanted it for the longest time. My boy, my boy loves love. You know? Junior's Junior's a softie, bro. People, but there's even a time where Junior, because Junior always spoke about this knowledge on like relationships on the type of woman you must have blah 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 some people used to even think like ah why does it seem like junior doesn't want a honey why does it seem like junior hates honeys he's a misogynist and whatnot and then boom 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 you got in a relationship i said yo <laughs> i'm just saying it's like a misogynist and then look now relationship and he's got the girl of his dreams you know what i'm saying and then yeah i'm on you know, yeah and then me on my side, bro, like I said. So, Junior's very logical, bro. I'm a, I'm a, I like to say, I'm a feelings person. I work of intuition. So, when I meet her, I will know. And I know I'm probably going to meet her in, like, macro. You know what I'm saying? Buying, like, eggs. <laughs> Buying eggs. I'm not, I'm not going to meet her diamond walk. I'm not going to meet her in the club. I'm going to meet her in macro. You're buying not going to meet her like, wearing this hat. And, Tell like, me. buying... Yeah, no, she's not going to be wearing that hat. Tell I'm like Roy Boss. <laughs> you know what even happened this week, right? How... Okay, Julian, mm. ask, can I ask something? When it comes, did you, did you feel, okay, you know what, she's the one? Or which one do the most? Was the feeling of she's the one? Or was some quality? Which one do you I think it... I think even when I probably saw that she was the one, because I already built myself in that period of time when it's like, not that I was looking for the qualities, but it's almost like you feel it. And I, not that I, not that I okay. blocked it out, but it was like, look, I'm then not going to just lead based on this feeling. What I want to do is keep on still building this authentic life of myself anyway and stuff now. And it's like, I've still got this mission that I need to sort out and stuff now. 
But the, what I'm grateful for is that during that process, what God is, is aligned to that person that understood me even before I got to the top. So it just made more logical sense when I just connected the dots looking backwards that it was an alignment. Yeah, yeah. I love what you said because the reason apparently I was asking that question because, um, you know, Siko, you just said... I will know, bro. You will, will know. And personally, I will know. And God has told me I will know. Come again? And when I know, I'm going to call you guys. I'm going to say, yo, okay. This is the one. But here's... And, and Junior spoke about it already. I think, for me, I always talk about deserving, you know. You know, I believe in law of attraction. And I think to get the kind of a girl that you want, maybe you need about 90 days or six months or a year or two years actually working towards deserving the no kind sense. of a girl that you want in the future. So when you, girl, whatever time that is, when you meet that girl, you're going to feel it. That's it. Okay, this is the one. You see, it's the time of deserving. So... Uh, before then, maybe we go sleep, my boy. I can say, maybe you know, let's let's talk about this in public. Get about maybe just just six months of being forecast and just. Well, let me to tell you, you see, here, right you know? now, I'm just working on myself, <laughs> and I'm working on the on the man. Ah. Of the <laughs> <laughs> so that I can manifest my hand. No, let me tell you, you know what even happened ah. yesterday, right? I also want to ask you a question, also, yeah, afterwards, yeah. Okay, <laughs> this question. Uh, you know, yesterday I wanted to get something from Macro, right? And I was like, hey, I don't feel like going in Macro. But then I said, no, man. Let me go to Macro. I might, I might meet my wife in the aisle <laughs> while I'm shopping for groceries. She's also shopping for groceries, you know what I'm saying? Because right. if she's at Macro at, on, on, on a Tuesday at like 11 o'clock, I know she's got her head in the right place, bro. Because like, Good woman, go to Macro, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The baddies go to Woolworths. <laughs> I'm not going to meet at Woolworths. I'm going to meet at Macro. <laughs> you feel what yeah, I'm saying? Big... So, Six, yeah. what is it worth to you to have a partner that is not argumentative and won't give you a headache just based on how stressful your life is and how much work it actually takes to build your business. What is it worth to you to actually have a partner that is not no. argumentative in terms of nyara, 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 but it just has conversations with you, doesn't have to raise their voice and stress you out? What is that worth to you? You know what it is, right? So any woman that comes into my life needs to understand um, these pointers, right? So you see right now, right? Yeah, I can hear you. You see right now, I'm chilling in my yeah. office, right? I am, I am super peaceful, right? Look, look at my view. I've got a crazy view in Santon. Like, I'm, I'm overlooking all of Santon, and I am so happy alone. So when you come in my life, that, that standard of happiness can't drop. As soon as you drop it, I'm out. You know what I'm saying? Because the thing about me, I am happy alone. I love myself. You know what I'm saying? When I'm alone, I even laugh alone. I'm the happiest alone. So when you come in my life, it's not a need. I don't need a partner. I'm not looking for one. So you must add. As soon as you're argumentative, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, ah, baby girl, you know what? I don't think I'm the guy for you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, because already life itself is already so stressful enough. You know, I believe that the place where you settle down, it needs to be peace. When you step outside of your house, it's war. You know, there's, there's your ops, the people that don't like you the jealous mother effers, there's all that. It's war outside. Life itself is a fight. When I come home, it needs to be peace, yo. I need to just lay my head and then I must be like, oh, love, you feel like heaven. When you stop feeling like heaven, yo, no way. I'm not about to have war inside my house. Can you help peaceful ladies? Listen, can't hear nothing. Can hear my chair squeaking. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so like, that's, Alone. So how do you how do you see someone that is so happy alone? It's hard. So that's why I say the woman that God is gonna give me is gonna be like extraordinary. Cause I am hard to please. I'm not easy to please because I'm so happy alone. So for someone to come in my life and like add, it means you're an extraordinary person. You know what I'm saying? I don't look for happiness in, in people. 
I look for happiness here. And that's why a lot of people like get in relationships and date. They're all trying to find happiness in each other because people aren't fine being alone. But also me, when I meet someone that's happy being alone, imagine your person is happy being alone, you happy being alone, and then you guys come in a relationship both happy. Imagine 